everybody what the fuck is going on welcome back to cooking with bird martinez the one the only bird motherfucking martinez bitch what's up everybody how's everybody doing i hope you're doing good in the motherfucking neighborhood i hope um you know you're relaxed you're not thinking about these negative ass shits you know the corona the corona que chinga su madre so i feel like things people are adapting now you know um my always tells me that it takes 21 days to get used to some to make something into a fucking when you get used to something and then you do it and you do it and you do it so you're just gonna do it i don't know what the fuck that's called but he always tells me it's 21 days to make it a habit yes 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 okay bitch so let's let's get into it and i've been making videos I have, I have all these ideas in my head but luego is I get busy with the salsas and I get busy with, you know, life. And I'm like, hey, I haven't made a video. I haven't made a video. But I feel like when it comes out organically, like, I don't want to be, like, obligated to do something. Because me, when I feel obligated, I feel like, like, I'm a fucking bird, you know what I'm saying? So when I feel obligated, I don't want to be there no more. I don't want to do that no more. So I do this because I love it. And ching is madre, bitch. Anyways, right here, I'm making some roast beef for Mario. Because today, Mario Martinez, my chorizo, is coming home early. He always gets home like 9 or 10. But today he's getting home like in 14 minutes. So I'm so excited. I got your bitch on my dick in the hole. Wanna ride it? Okay. Let's, let me give my little shout out. First, I want to give a shout out to Nina. Um, Her and her daughter. Her, that's the lady that um gave me the stickers, gave me the box, gave me the shirts. She is a motherfucking boss bitch when I'm telling you we um we did like a FaceTime and she was like she wrote everything down. She said this is what you you should work on. You know, always check your emails, it's very important. Like bitch, I appreciate that shit a lot because you know people always tell me, rock with your bird, rock with your bird. But to push and be persistent, he me dice, you know what? Esto es lo que tienes que hacer para que te pongas al tiro, bitch. I love that. Also, um, I'm going to make this recipe. It's this marinara sauce. Homemade marinara sauce. Or that ass. Like, I'm not even going to take the, este, como se dice, credit. This is Madeline's Kitchen on her channels on YouTube. Este, I've always wanted to. I've made marinara sauce from the beginning. From whatever I thought I'd made it. But this bitch, first time, I'm going to use fresh stuff. Fresh oregano and basil. So thank you for your video. Also shout out to Susie Fernandez, West girl, no West Texas girl, um, Blanca Guyen. She she Blanca Guyen. She sent me some um, make easy up, bitch. I've been looking for this, and Mario always telling, please Mario, can you buy me some? And he's like, yeah, I'll get you some, but he can never find it. So thank you very much. Also. Um, shout out to Mary and Royal uh, for always rocking with me. And shout out to Ana Miranda and her eight kids and her chorizo that has always rocked with her. Backed her up through thick and thin and fuck her suegra. Mm -hmm. I know. But it's because some suegras, they could be really, really like a lot. You know what I'm saying? That's why I always tell Mandy and Sophia. Hopefully when I get to be an old bitch, I'm not that old bitch with an attitude. I'm not going to be in my kid's business. I'm not going to, you know, try to change them or try to, you know, manipulate his wife or do the most. Is, you know, fuck all that. Just let them be free and fly away and learn on themselves. If she, if she cheats on him and he goes back with her, that's his motherfucking business. That's his motherfucking dick. Fuck all that. Okay, bitch. So for this recipe, of course, my little horse, we're going to use some tomato. I'm going to use tomato roma. Two, four, eight. I don't know how to count. I think it's eight. We're going to use some extra olive oil. Extra virgin olive oil. We're going to use some tomato paste for that as. Of course, my little course. My course. We're going to use some basil. Mira que chula. I love the smell of that. There's a pasta that I make. It smells so good. My mom. One time my sister made that pasta for my mom and my mom was like, hell no, the vacas eat that. The cows eat this. But I'm a fucking cow, bitch. I'm a motherfucking cow. I don't give a fuck. And we're going to use some fresh oregano. Aquí está. No está muy verde porque I had it in the fridge. Y creo que le got a little bit too cold. 
Okay, we're gonna use um, garlic cloves. Of course, bitch, garlic is live. We're gonna use some, como se llama? Salt. Se me olvido, wey, se me olvido. And some sugar. Her recipe, she had, also has wine. But bitch, I don't know about wine. I wish I know about wine so I could drink some motherfucking wine. So I could feel like a fancy ass bitch and be like, bitch, with my, with my fucking wine. Like, but anyways, I talk too much. Already fucking five minutes. Yeah, I need help. I need help in this bitch. I need help. Help, I need. Fuckers, okay. So I forgot to tell you guys that we're gonna use an onion. Okay, bitch. Let me tell you something. I've always said, if I wasn't Mexican, I would like to be Italian. Reason number one. To me, Italian is not like white. I know some of them motherfuckers look white. Pero I feel like they have like a lot of culture for the food. Y no mames, no más como que. No sé, something about you, baby. Drive me crazy. Something about those, something shit. Blows my mind. But anyways, I'm talking too much. No sé qué tengo. Les digo, I have ADHD, but nobody fucking believed me. I went to the doctor and everything for that. Este, I also went to anger management. I know, I look all happy and shit. But I feel like the people that are crazy like me, that talk a lot, that están todas contentas, either you're like over here, like super, super happy, or you're over here, super, super crazy and mad. There's no in between. Like, that's, this is how God made us. Estamos medio zapados. Um... So me and Mario were like, we were about to separate or we were trying to work it out, but it wasn't working out. And I was always screaming and always fighting with everybody. So I, he told me, you know what, you should go to like the anger management therapy or whatever. You see if we go to the señor and um, went to a couple sessions or whatever. And he was always eating and being weird. But I feel like it did help me because I always felt like, it, like being crazy was part of me. Like, my dad's side, like, you know when you have a dad, but he's not really in your life, you always think, like, oh, I said, what if I'm evil like him? Like, my dad, he's a fucking cokehead. He's a fucking, he would um, cut the, the, uh, como se dice, the tails of the cats. You guys know what a cat is? The tails? The tails for the balance. Well, that's what Mexicans think. That's how they balance themselves. So, um, he would cut the tail off and then go up in the mountain in the cerro and like throw the cat to see if he would fall on his feet. Like who the fuck does that, does that to cat, bruh? My dad, yeah, he did that. So I always felt like my mom told me stories and he, even he told me stories of shit that he did. So like I always felt like it was part of me, like, oh, I can't change. I'm gonna be crazy like my dad. This is just who I am, woo woo woo. But it's not even like that. Like yes, your dad is or like somebody in your family is evil, but that does not mean that you're gonna be like that. So one day I was like, Chinga tu madre, you know, I'm not like my dad. She, he, maybe he might be my dad, but he's just my a sperm donor. He wasn't there for me. And the time that he was there for me, he fucked me up. So why should I, you know, care what he is or what he, you know, fuck it. You are who you are and only because your dad or your mom or anybody in your family is evil doesn't mean that you have to be evil. You could be better, bitch. So I'm cutting them really, really thin or little because I don't like big ass pieces, especially in the in the marinara sauce. I don't like them all up in my mouth. Better than in your mouth. In your motherfucking mouth. Por eso le, I like to ponerle filo. Para que esté bien chingona. Mira que chulada de vieja soy. No mames. Like a damn bitch. Just kidding. I'm complimenting myself. But bitch, if you don't compliment yourself, what the fuck? How do you expect people to compliment you? Me? Porque luego me pongo a ver mis own videos, ¿verdad? Because I like to see the evolution of bird. Cuando I barely start making videos, I be like, what's up everybody? So, welcome back to Cooking with Bear Martinez. And then, when time went on, I was like, what's up everybody? What the fuck is up? Pero I would miss stuff, you know? And then I got more comfortable, more comfortable. And luego chingue su madre one day, I was just like, what's up everybody? What the fuck is up? And um. I just want to tell everybody, if you guys want to make videos, if you some madre, just go for it. The more you think about it, the more time you're wasting. So I feel like if you want to do it, do it. Because you know, you're going to get canas, your, your titties are going to get saggy. Even if your titties are saggy already. You know what I'm saying? Hay un chingo de pinches TikTokers. TikTokers. TikTok. How do you say it? 
tiktokteros que son acá como señores y señoras and I just love to see the ladies like están todas allá rucas like in their 70s and they're like fuck yeah chingue su madre my neighbors are looking at me like I'm crazy let me get my garlic cloves so I'm using I'm finally using my new tripod because I didn't know how to make it face down so I was using the the legs of the other one and except for this one but then now I'm like fuck it so I was fucking around with it and I finally got it finally I finally got it yeah 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 my neighbors are from Guatemala but they're cool as fuck she I don't know how many times I knocked at her door and said hey do you have a cup of milk hey do you have a cup of sugar hey do you have a, some oil like so many times and she would never ask me because she was like, I don't know, I think she felt embarrassed. So one time I was like, hey, like, why don't you ever ask for something? Like, I'm here, that's what I'm here for. And she's like, no, I'm not gonna lie. Like, I don't, she doesn't feel comfortable. And she, she doesn't have like a, to cook, she has a gas tank. And she has like a little one, like this big. And I said, how long does it last you? And she's like, about a week. I'm like, so every week you have to go refill that shit? She's like, yeah. And I'm like, well, why don't you fill up the big one? And she's like, but I don't have a truck. And I said, I have a, my father-in-law has an old truck. I could take you. When I told her that, she couldn't believe it. I guess because I'm a pocha. I speak English or something. She thinks that we're like different. But bitch, what the fuck? We're the same. And if I could help out, especially when it comes to cooking, because she like cooks for like a lot of people, because I don't know, I think they pay her. You know when um, people come from like Guatemala or something and they don't have a wife, they pay somebody to do it for them. I think that's what she does because she always has guys in her house. I think they're her nephews and her family. But yeah, it's good to help other bitches. You know what I'm saying? And she she's always like looking at me because I cuss a lot. And I told her, I'm like, I'm just like that, señora. Like, no se, no se pene, yo soy una pinche vieja loca. I'm boiling the tomatoes because you're supposed to use like crushed tomatoes or something but I don't have that so I'm just gonna use like you know fresh tomatoes and you can never go wrong with tomates you know what I'm saying who records who walks in heels in the treadmill of course la Sofia la tortilla in the motherfucking house ooh 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 got the garlic right here I don't have one of those thingies to mince the garlics, but I really like to chop it, chop stuff. I could use a processor, but ching is mad, we're already here. So what I do is I smash them like this. You wanna see Sophia? Yes. Smash them like this. And I go like that. And I just keep doing the same process over and over again. Let's see. And I like when I smash it, cause it smells good. It smells amazing, boss. Yes. What's up, Mama? And your nails get healthier. And your nails get healthier. So if you're in the morning, well, tell them what your breakfast was. Avocado with quesadilla and with, what is it called? Spinach. Yes, queen. Y ahorita quieren hacer unas cho chocolate chip cookies? Mm -hmm. Este, like the best chocolate chip cookie of the world or some shit. That noise is the, the pot. I'm also making some chicken. Ooh, I'm making happy. roast beef, chicken, marinara sauce, shingles madre. We got the remix to the remix mix mix. So I was saying her name wrong. It's Madeline's Kitchen. Um, it's not Madeline's Kitchen. If you guys know, I don't know how to. If, now, as you know, as you guys may now know, I do not know how to speak. Okay? But that does not mean that I do it on purpose. I'm just like. Doo -doo -doo. Okay. So. I already got the garlic ready. So now we're gonna go to the pot, put some oil, olive oil up in that hole. And yeah, ching is my lane. So I'm gonna put my olive oil up in this hole, like that much. Ooh, ooh, ooh. And we're gonna put the onion. Wow. They were all fucking fighting at each other. Right now it was like, it sounded like some kid was getting killed in this house. <laughs> I did the nothing wrong, so. Sophia, you are something else. She was like, hey! <laughs> 
Sofía, si un día vienen acá y los vienen los policías van a estar chingando que te están matando y de la chingada. Y te voy a decir que te lleven. Yo no sé que estás. You're special. Ya sé que estás especial. 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 Ya sé que estás And then she shakes her butt. <laughs> La abuela, she was like, "Hey, Sofia, don't do it." She even showed her a fucking video of a what was it? A stripper? Like a girl, um, showing her butt walking. Yeah, she showed her a fucking. A ver. She showed her a video of a naked girl twerking and told her, "Oh, that's gonna be you. If you're gonna keep if you keep doing that." <laughs> and I told Sofia, "You could be the fuck whoever the fuck you want. If you like, you know, shake your butt, shake it a little bit. If you like to." No se viste sexy, pues así es ella. Like, I told the grandma, you know what? She got it from her mama. She was like a little hoe. Yeah. But it's not a hoe. Oh, my prune juice. Pa' cagar. Pa' cagar. Pa' cagar. Chucky, we have the garlic. It's very, very thin. Very, very beautiful. You know what I'm saying? It really smells amazing. A mí, ¿quién wash the board? Porque estamos a cortar el video. Sí, amigo. Y vamos a mover. A mover, a mover. A mover la colita. Porque si no la mueve, se te va a poner malita. Come on, Sofía. A mover, a mover. A mover la colita. Porque si no la mueve, se te va a poner malita. A mover, a mover. A mover la colita. Si no la mueve, se te... ¡Ay, viene el otro, cabrón! ¡Ándale, a mover la colita! No mames. And their grandma gets a heart attack when she sees baby Mario moving his butt. <laughs> Ay, I'm a ser joto. He's gonna be gay because he shakes his butt. Yes, the little boy is just happy. Huh, Sofia? Huh, Mandy? Ooh, this is gonna be so good, bitch. Mm. So now we're gonna put the tomato paste. Mm. I've never used tomato paste. I always use this thing. Tomato sauce. Tomato sauce. But I guess tomato paste is a big difference. It looks like toothpaste, but red. Not really. It's just like really thick. I wonder how they make it. They get all the tomatoes and squish them together. Okay, now we're gonna remix that bitch. Remix it to the remix to the remix mix mix, bitch. You thought that was, the girls are peeling the tomatoes. Tomato, 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 tomatoes, Mmm. Mm -hmm. There you go, yo. Instead of using this, you could use the biggest, de, ¿cómo se llama? Crushed tomatoes or la tomato sauce. I didn't have any, so that's why I use regular tomatoes. So for the marinara sauce, one of the main ingredients, like, since me and Sofia have been fucking with marinara sauce, is sugar, huh? Yes. We always say sugar and oregano is the fucking soul of the fucking marinara sauce. I don't care what they say. We um, We know it's some bomb shit when they put sugar in it. One tablespoon, or según yo, I'm gonna remake that bitch. And this is where I'm supposed to put the wine. Pero, como que le eche modelo. Should I put some modelo in it? No. Okay, no, you don't need like wine. If it's there, okay, eat it. Pero when when it evaporates, the alcohol gets out. Don't you know that's fucking science? No que muy scientific. I know it's not scientific. Okay, do now we're gonna add this tomato, los tomatitos, tomatitos, putitos. We're gonna remix that bitch for the better sabor. Desde el cielo, una hermosa mañana. Desde el cielo, una hermosa mañana. La Guadalupana, la Guadalupana, la Guadalupana bajo el tepeyac. Bitch, fuck all you fucking hoes. That say that I pray, but I curse. What the fuck does that even mean, bruh? Like, only because I curse. No, Sophia, cursing is not a sin. Only because I curse, I'm supposed to pray to the fucking devil or what? I'm gonna suck my ass. Oh my goodness. So we're gonna let it remix. Mm, smells amazing. 
So the one, the only, Mandy Martinez is gonna teach you guys how to cut herbs. Okay. Herbs. Same. Okay. Basil. Okay. So first, mm -hmm. you layer the leaves. Right now we have two, so I'll do that. And mm -hmm. then you roll it up in the side like this. Wow, professional. Mm -hmm. And then you cut it like this. Like this and like this and like this and up. When you do it, don't put your finger on top. Why not, Miss Man? And also do a claw so you don't cut yourself. Or like this? Same. If you do this, you have more control. More control over your life and your Same. soul. I don't know, since we like a lot, like it a lot. Nomás le vamos a quitar así. Porque esta también, let me taste it. It's not bad. But I feel like we should only get the leaves. Same. También las que están prietitas, we should put them on the side. They smell so good. Mmm. Huele a mi pernocha. But yeah. This is how my pussy smells. Oh cringe, cringe. Oh my god, we have to talk like that in front of your kids. We're gonna be so ghetto. We're gonna be so wretched. Wait, wait, do we have to open in the corner? Esta porque está morenita, mami. Esta ya no está bien. Okay. It's like cilantro. <clears throat> like cilantro cuando. Well, you know what I'm gonna use them for? I'm gonna dry them up. So we can have oregano dry. Dry oregano. Same. Pero por qué el oregano de the one that's dry? Por qué looks so different? You don't say por qué. Mira. No, I don't think so. Oh, no, it looks the same. Bien loca. Look at the react. It looks different. Doesn't it? Yeah. But I guess it's like me. If you dried me up, I would look different too. Yeah. I wonder how I'm going to look when I, get, when I die. Mama, mira como un pinche palo ahí todo muerto. Like a stick. Like a dead stick. So, how do you know what it means? Palo, te voy a agarrar palazos, wey. Palo, palo, palito, palo, eh. Eh, palo, palito, palo, eh. There's a song like that. There's a song in Spanish. There's a song of everything. There's there's even a song called um, <laughs> the Flying Cat. El gato, el gato volador. El gato volador. There's even one that's called. No quiero trabajar. No quiero trabajar. No quiero trabajar. No quiero trabajar. There's one called coronavirus. <laughs> yeah, there's Sacame la botella. Que me va a dar el nombre de ella. And then the beeper. That's our theme song for our wedding. Every fucking five minutes we played it. Okay, I think that's enough. Bitch, bitch, bitch. I feel like the motherfucking Italian abuelita aquí, chingue su madre. Para que coman los hijos de su puta madre. ¿Qué pasó, mamá? So, Sofia wants to show her creations. Don't be embarrassed. You that bitch. You know what I'm saying? Own that shit. So she made her little right here. Y acá también. Mira que chulada. You're so creative, mamá. Este. Because we're going to eat pasta with roast beef. Chingue su madre. As I'm making the marinara sauce from scratch. Not from scratch. Because from scratch is when you pick up the tomatoes too soda, no? O como es from scratch, scratch? Mandy. From scratch, like, doing it with ingredients. When you scratch your ass and then you do it? No. <laughs> So, mira que chulada. Toda creative, mamá. Now we're gonna add. Ay, wait. La sal. Salt. Like that much. Tablespoon. I don't add as much salt con esta porque this gets really salty. You know what I'm saying? I was waiting one of the salsas. Y me salió como too salty. And I even asked Mandy, is this too salty? What do you think? Da -da -da -da. And Mandy's like, it's good enough for me. It's good for me because she likes salty food. So I have to redo it again. But it's because if you send a chingadera and then they don't like it, it sucks. So we're going to add the basil. Basil. Si, Sofia, wouldn't you be mad if you order something and it's a little too salty? Yes. And the oregano pedajo. Yeah. We're going to remake that bitch. Que <laughs> bitch, bitch. Mira que chulada. Mmm, 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 mmm. No mames, wait, look at that color, that thickness, that motherfucking green stuff in there. Bitch. I know you could guys could buy this like three bucks, four bucks. But making it yourself is another feeling. It's like you accomplish something in your motherfucking life. It feels like, you know, you got your kids waiting for the fucking spaghetti for the table. I don't know. I'm a whole mess. But I'm very proud of this shit right here because it's very bonito. You know what I'm saying? 
I love it. I grew up with fucking pasta. You know, I feel like pasta is for like moms that are busy and moms that are not busy porque the kids love it. You know what I'm saying? We all have a memory of a fucking pasta. Growing, when I was growing up, when I was 16, my mom kicked me out, right? Why not? I feel like she kicked me out, but she didn't want, she wanted me to come back. So I, I was like, fuck, da, 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 talking shit. And she had a red salsa on the table. And I don't know what, but I got mad, but I didn't, I didn't throw it, but it fell right when I was leaving. So she was crying and she was on the floor and she said that I threw the salsa and it was all red everywhere. And I left for two weeks. I was like all over the fucking place. First I was with my friend, you know, it was cool. But then her mom started getting kind of annoyed. You know, y el, el muerto y el arrimado a los dos días apesta. The dead and the person that's like right there, como se llama, leeching off you. Two days, start stanking. So, um... The mom was like, you know, when the fuck is she gonna leave? So I was in the bus stop, the big ass sweater and sweats, and this lady passes by and she says, are you pregnant or something? And I was like, no, did somebody rape you? I don't know why the fuck she thought that I was raped and pregnant. So she said that she was gonna give me $20 or something, but she was like, she was trying to be nice to me, but at the same time, she was trying to like, she was scared of me. Like I was gonna like rob her or something. Anyways, I remember that day, the first day I got back home, my mom's face, after I ran, after I wasn't home for two weeks, I was on flaca, you know, more flaca than I am. She looked at me and she just started cooking. She made a pollo and chile rojo. She made my favorite pasta. My favorite pasta is like spaghetti with the marinara sauce. It's a mozzarella cheese. This one, mozzarella. And um, she would put milk and it turned pink, like pinkish, pinkish orangey. That was my favorite. And I remember like feeling like, bitch, I'm home. My mama cooking for me again. And um, I regret doing that shit to her because I was fucked up. But I mean, I felt very like, oh, my family doesn't love me because I was beefing it with my stepdad and it was just a fucking, everybody kicked me out. My mama kicked me out, my stepdad, my stepfather kicked me out, uncle kicked me out. Hey, lucky who we got here, Sofia la motherfucking tortilla grating the cheese. As you may know, a lot of us little kids grew up doing this. So we gotta let keep the ¿cómo se dice? Tradition. Tradition. You know what I'm saying? Aquí tengo mi little thingies. I love that picture because I'm a Mexican dressed like a Mexican. And my little magnets magnets from the Vidala style. All your notes I have to take them off porque I leave them like a week y luego los quito porque se va a mirar bien feo. I'm gonna look like a hoarder. So I'm putting them in my little little folder. Found the when I'm an old bitch. You know what I'm saying? And nobody likes me no more. I'm be like, bitch, did you guys know who the fuck I am? Who I was? I was Bird, the motherfucking teen is. Bird, motherfucking teen is. Cooking with Bird, cooking with Bird, motherfucking teen is. Got Mario's roast beef. It takes a while, but it's really good. Mario and um, Mandy, even Sophia like it. We're gonna eat some of that. Here in the motherfucking house, in the motherfucking house. Put it in your mouth. Dinga is chicken with chipotle. Mm -hmm. Here we have the pasta. La pasta. It's like um the curly ones. This is the one that Sophia chose. We have the queso, and we have the marinara sauce that I put in the mason jar because we're only gonna use half, and I made enough for like today and enough for next time. Yes, bitch, look at that beauty. Mira que chulada. A poco no enfado, güeyes. A poco no enfado. <laughs> roast beef sample. Ever since we were young, este, vamos a ver carne asada. Te lo quieres comer tú, cabrón. Este es para tu papi. Y luego, you come back for yours. I know, mi, mi tragona. But like, oh my God, it actually looks like a pussy. Mm. What up, motherfuckers? It's me, Lucy, like your pussy. I am back. I've been gone for so long. But now, bird motherfucking TVs told me I could be back. And now I'm alive. I'm alive. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck is going on? Chingue, chingue, chingue su madre. Ooh, put it in my mouth. Ooh, another one. Gut fuckers. 
It's me, the dead pussy. Nobody, nobody in this world more excited than Sofia to get this, to taste this. Porque ella le encanta la pasta. Me da mami? Remember, I was making pasta three days straight. Yeah, te gusta. What's your second favorite food? Burger, cheeseburger. You like cheeseburger? Remember you wanted me to make a cheeseburger cake for you? Yeah. For your birthday? Yeah. ¿Y qué más te gusta? Pero te asusta. Oh, I know. Oh, chipotle? Chipotle. Mm -hmm. So, we're using these pastas like this. Y luego we're gonna put marinara. Like this arriba, pero remix it también. Porque no like it cuando el mar echan poquita. Le tenemos que echar mucha. You mucha. Need put, you need to put extra because when you remix it, it's a little bit. Mm -hmm. Un chingo y un montón, bitch. Oh, un chingo y un montón, bitch. No sé, chaparrita para chaparrita. What can I eat it? You can put cheese on it. Oh, cheese. Ahí está el queso. Para que pique. No, para que agarre. Mira, güey, no mames. No mames. No, 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 no mames. No, no, no mames. No, no, no mames. Mm -hmm. Y el quesito. Y a chingar su madre. Yes, bitch. Cheers, motherfuckers. Mmm. He's all bad. No mames. Could you taste the um the basil? Yeah. So fresh and so clean, clean. I really like the what do you call it, the sauce. So good. Mm hmm. Next time, te la voy a hacer with me. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. Mm, 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 and we're walking and my neighbor with the um kumquats tree he's an old man right he's like what 80 years old maybe 78 he's really really old he saw me he looked at me he went like this <laughs> i was like so yo it's me erica he's like that's mala are you sick i'm like no i'm not sick i'm just not wearing makeup he's like segura like are you sure He's like, you scared me. Like, I scared him with no makeup on. But I feel like he was being a funny. I don't feel like he was trying to offend me. Because he's like, you know that old school Mexicans that are always being funny? Okay, they're always like saying jokes and, ay, porque estás bien fea, pinche vieja, like that. ¿Ya te vas a sentar, güey? I get sleepy. Sleepy, pero todavía estás comiendo, cabrona. Yeah, I taste that. Anyways, motherfuckers, I hope you guys like this recipe. I really fucking do. You know what I'm saying? I agree. Bomb. Bomb. Skis. Skis, motherfuckers. Thank you for the motherfucking love. Thank you for the motherfucking hate. Chinga su madre. A toda madre. A un desmadre. To all my bird gang, 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 gang. Motherfuckers. Peace and motherfucking love. Se te cayó? Sí. Love. El chicle se me pegó. El chicle se me pegó. Pi, 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 pi